Hey guys, my name is Brendan Tees from Hooper. Today, you're gonna to learn how to do a crossover like Alan Iverson in three simple steps. My name is Brendan Tees and I've played professional basketball for over a decade. I've learned from some of the best players and best coaches from all over the world. My aim is to teach as many kids as possible. This is why I'm giving you the eight ways to score when attacking the basket free training video. You can find it in the description below or at www.hooper.com.au forward slash attack the basket. So like I said, today we're gonna learn how to do the Allen Iverson crossover. We've all seen the famous footage of Allen Iverson in an isolation play with Michael Jordan in front of him. The whole crowd gets to their feet and he finally gets his chance as a rookie to take on the best player of all time. What he does is he comes into the play, sets Michael Jordan up with the dribble, all right? Sees his reaction, sees if he bites, and then he hits him with his famous Allen Iverson crossover. So today we're gonna learn how to do that crossover in three simple steps. Your first step is you're gonna use your feet to set up your defender. So it doesn't matter which foot's higher on your defender, you can attack either way with this one. So you're gonna dribble in, okay? You're gonna step in one direction and try to get your defender to twist his feet or try to cut you off this way. So that's step one. Using your feet, you wanna pretend like you're blowing by your defender in this direction. Number two, you wanna bring your dribble out nice and wide, okay? Be careful not to get a carry call or a carry violation. You need to keep your, uh, keep your hand behind the ball or on top of the ball. But you wanna be nice and wide and you need to get nice and low. The number of times that I've seen this move uh, somebody cross over into the defender's feet is a big reason why you need to keep it wide, you need to keep it low, keep it close to your body. So step one, use your feet, set up your defender, make him think you're going in this direction. Number two, get your hands nice and wide. Number three, you wanna load this leg, okay? So all of your weight's on this leg, shifting your body this way, and then the last second, crossing over, low and wide, attacking your defender's hip, hopefully getting on the ring. So there you go guys, three steps that you can use for the Allen Iverson crossover. If you wanna comment below, let me know how you're going with your practice, or you can tag me on Instagram at Hooper Basketball.